but we want to stay on something that students do like, and that is this right here. Mobile phones, there have been various developments right around the world to bring mobile telephony to the masses, making smartphones affordable for many, many, many different people, enabling them stand to get access to the internet and the services and goods and other things that are available right there. This, of course, has contributed to a concept that has been dubbed leapfrogging, the ability to be able to access well, goods and services that in the past would only have been possible through very heavy investment. Well, to speak into some of these developments, especially developments in mobile telephony, and to talk to us about what some of these have been, we have in the studio, right in the heart of the CBD at our IM building studios, Cynthia Njiru, she is the head of marketing and PR at Infinix. Infinix, of course, is a brand of the Tansion company, which is headquartered in China, one of the world's largest companies, and I think fifth in circulation globally. Last year, Cynthia, Karibu sana. Now, first of, of course, Thank you the very fact much. that uh, Infinix has uh, recently been in the news for a very, very big launch out of Dubai. Talk to us about what exactly you are putting out into the market and what exactly we can expect. Well, Peter, uh, we recently launched our flagship last week in Dubai, and uh, it's a very, very high tech phone. It's called the Infinix 05. And uh, what we want to do is give our customers the best in terms of specifications and also affordability. So what this phone has is actually giving customers a very good high-end experience with a camera because you find most of the times you have to break the bank when you want to buy a phone with a very nice camera. So what we're giving our customers is the opportunity to actually experience very superior features at an affordable price. That is our main agenda. And also make sure that we listen to our customers because our customers are our number one uh, research uh, and development team. Well, talk to us about some of the innovation that you have had to go through, especially the fact that, as you indicated there, this has previously been the preserve of what would have been termed very expensive hardware out there. What exactly has the company done to be able to bring this to uh, well, Africans at uh, such affordable prices. Well, Peter, if uh, you can uh, do your research, in 2013, phones were priced at uh, phones that were priced at 23,000 Kenya shillings are now half priced in 2016 by maybe 9,700 Kenya shillings, and this is because you see with technology. Trends are supposed to help you uh, get access to affordable gadgets, you know. You're not supposed to break the bank when uh, getting gadgets uh, when te has, because technology has advanced. So for Infinix, we have provided our customers with devices that bring them and make them up to date with uh, current technology trends because right now you can access or rather get a device for less than 10K that has the latest Android, which is a Nougat, instead of having to wait for it or getting a device that would only uh, let you run on an old OS. So this is what we're current, current, uh, currently trying to do. We're trying to give our customers uh, better technology uh, with our devices that we're launching right now. And we want them to experience firsthand these uh, new trends uh, instead of uh, having to go or having to and, uh, go through uh, inexpensive uh, things. Yes, talk to us about some of the features and the fact that this phone is especially rugged, especially because it is targeted at the African continent. We, of course, do know that the conditions here can be atrocious for phones, either consistently being dropped because you're multitasking, and when they do drop, they drop on really rough surfaces. And the sort of thing that you then have to run a really, really top-notch maintenance system to enable customers continue to enjoy these uh, gadgets at their optimum. So, like currently, let me just talk about our flagship, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yes, please. The Infinix 05 has a back dual camera 12 and 13 megapixels. Mm -hmm. It has a 64 GB ROM. It has a 6 GB RAM. And the Pro version has a 128 GB mm -hmm. ROM. So you see, for such a device, if you are the kind of person, like for example yourself, and you're a reporter, and you're always going out and about your business, and you don't want to have to go around town carrying your DSLR, you're carrying your mics, and uh, you have a story that you want to cover. 
If you have such a device, you're able to capture high quality images, high quality videos at 4K that you can edit and use. Mm -hmm. And you see, these are the kind of technology trends that we're giving our customers. And we have this device running on Gorilla. Uh, it has a Gorilla Con 3. Mm -hmm. It's running on the latest uh, OS. We've also developed our own user interface that we refer to as the XOS. Mm -hmm. So it's basically running on the latest XOS 3, which yes. is our current one. Mm -hmm. So basically, we we're giving our customers best designs, best camera features, a very good experience when you have to like uh, take out your phone in public, show it to the people. You don't have to get embarrassed with the designs. Mm -hmm. We have made sure that we have covered our customers on all ends. Mm -hmm. Well, and something that we are also big on is social listening. Yes. Well, finally, talk to us about the future very briefly as we come to the end of this conversation and the end of the show. Talk to us about what the future holds for these phones and this brand. What exactly can your consumers expect going forward? Our customers should expect better camera features, of course, because that is what we are known for, and that's what mm -hmm. we are big for. OK. And they should also expect better designs and user, user experience. That is what we want to give our customers in the year 2018. We want to be the trendsetters in the smartphone industry. We want them to be proud of being Infinix users. That is our aim. That is what we want for our customers. And also, of course, better after-sale services, because we have a very strong after-sale service team. Well, yeah, indeed, that is what we want to give our customers. Indeed. Uh, well, Cynthia Njiru from the PR and marketing, thank you very much for your time. Of course, speaking into the flagship that the, phone, uh, that the company uh, did deploy from a few well, days ago in Dubai in something that was a global spectacle. Thank you very much for taking the time to talk to us. And of course, something that we will continue to speak into going forward as we continue to bring our customers up to speed on what the offerings are in the world of mobile telephony. Asante sana. Well, on